In the Tangi neighborhood of Wagadugu, Burkina Faso, New Love Kosheta is working on a machine that weaves the traditional cloth known in the country as Faso Damfani. The operating system is powered by a motor that rotates the entire machine. Everything is mechanized. I'm currently at about 80% and I just need to install the main motor. Eight days later, the machine is ready for delivery to a local weaver named Awayaogo. You can start the machine, do your household chores, sometimes stop it or leave it running while picking up your children from school. It's a good idea to help us, the weavers. Since 2008, Kusheta has been making things like traffic lights and ice-making freezers. He uses his mechanical skills to turn found materials into useful items. He has created over 15 different types of devices. I really like what he does in his business. He creates many inventions. He also trains young people, makes machines for irrigating vegetable gardens, and does some welding too. He does almost everything. I'm proud of him. Kushieta says he wants to expand even further and can do more. We work in a workshop, but we should be working in a production unit to set up units for rapid production. That's our current challenge. It's also a family business. His son, Feiko Kushieta, also dreams big, like his father. I would like us to have a production unit to create our machines in large quantities, to make at least 100 machines in a month so that we can fulfill our orders. Kushieta says he's making a good living and there's plenty of work to do. He even admits he sometimes has trouble delivering his inventions on time. To solve that problem, he wants to start sharing his engineering skills with young people so they can help him with the backlog of orders. For Gildas Da in Ouagadougou, Burkina Faso, this is Jackson Vunganyi, VOA News.